Exercise Beach Black provides us with the excellent opportunities to conduct large-scale day and night operational scenario that provides very good realistic training to all our air crew and as well as the Air Force engineers and the operators. The operators, when they plan for their mission, they have got certain configurations requirements for their aircraft. I will take that information, translate it down to the logistics side, tell them what is required. If the aircraft is going for air-to-air -air mission, it will require missiles. If it's going for air-to-ground missions, it will require bombs. On top of that, I monitor the aircraft status, ensuring that they are mission ready before I assign them to the air crew. I've been here before actually for this exercise back in my uh, NSF days. As an NSF man, we have to keep our currency level active. It also helps me to regain the knowledge that I might have forgotten or lost. Having come back uh, after four years, I, I do bring some experience to the flight line. You, you definitely have lessons that you learned in the past. And you come here, you share it with the younger NSFs or the regulars. They put a lot of trust in us and we have to do our due diligence to carry out our checks and ensure that the aircraft is ready to give the pilot the best possible aircraft for his mission. In Australia, especially in Trippish Black, they have the opportunity to, uh, to be trained in some of these aspects, including uh, weapons employment, as well as the uh, readiness of the air crew and also the maintenance crew. But the RSF must be good at what we do, so that when the moment is called upon to defend the countries with uh, our sophisticated hardware, our people must be confident and ready at all times to deal with the uncertainties today.